What is up YouTube? I am back. I'm back to my regular programming. Thank fuck. I am chomping at the bit to go thrifting. I can't fucking wait to go thrifting. I'm hanging for this. All right, so while I was on honeymoon holiday, I sold a shitload of stuff. So I've got all this crap. I got 20 items, 22 items, sorry. In my lucky two-time premiership, two-time premiership, Peel Thunder lucky bags. So in my lucky uh, Peel Thunder bags, I'm gonna go fucking uh, post them. Right along, let's just go. Let's just stop talking shit, let's do it. Let's do this. Let's do it. Right along. I'm back, baby. Come ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift all day. When you go down to Upshop Town, don't have a dog shit day. So ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift away. Woo. All right. Fuck, the traffic has been shit. Dog shit. The traffic has been dog shit on the way here, but that's all right. We're almost there. We get to... Uh, I feel like a junkie. It's been like weeks. Uh, let's scratch that thrift itch. I'm like a junkie. Let's scratch it. it. Took so long in the post office. I should have been in there for 10 minutes. There was no line as well. And then bloke fucking... The zombies in The Walking Dead had more brains than this dickhead. He didn't know what the fuck he was doing. All right, we're heading to three thrift shops, op shops. Uh, these ones are the ones where I found last year that toes to the nose shirt that I got 120 bucks for that I paid seven bucks for, that Hawaiian shirt. So fingers crossed, it's been a long time since I've been here. Bit of a drive there as well, worth it. Fuck, it's still hot here. It's hot like barley. And cheers for everyone putting up with all that other shit that uh, I put up. Uh, barley videos and munchies from other countries and all that, but it's just some fun. And uh, whatever other videos I did put out before this one. Um, but uh, yeah, I hadn't gone thrifting yet, so I had to make some uh, content, didn't I? My right, guys, let's scratch that thrift itch and let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do this. Woo! All right, guys, this is going to be a little bit of a uh, you guys help me out uh, right along, really, because uh, you'll tell me what I've missed. Because I'm going to look for clothes for the first time. I'm going to try and get clothes. Um, it's the same place where I found that uh, toast to the nose shirt that uh, scored me 120 bucks from seven dollars dvds are gone back up to three bucks cd's gone back up to two dollars they can go suck a major fucking dick because i'm not paying for that had a little look through the books once again we find twilight fuck that i'm fucking sick of it see it every goddamn op shop but uh i had a little look at the games here the games unfortunately weren't um any good they were fucking pretty dog shit and it's the way it goes, it's the way it goes, you gotta scratch that thrift itch and uh, get out there and have a little look. Toys were pretty pretty bare actually, there was hardly any toys compared to usual. Uh, thrift shops, compared to my markets, I'm not a big fan, but I'm now exploring the, look at that kitty, look at the kitty shirt! I should have brought it, I didn't buy it, should I have brought that? Five dollars. You tell me in the comments, should I have brought that kitty shirt? I could have wore it when the kitty comes up. Didn't think of that. That shirt looked alright, but I looked it up and on comps and couldn't really find anything uh, on it. I uh, found this OLI, Ollie, uh, baseball shirt. Five dollars was a good price. I did message uh, Brad from Two Aussie Frifters. And uh, he said he couldn't find anything either, so I left it. There's a fake Collingwood jersey. Make sure when you're uh, doing your bingo, you get the proper jerseys, not the fake ones. So I left that. Still looking for... There's a Tommy Hilfiger jeans shirt. 
I didn't buy it. Should I have got that for $5? You tell me. Should I have brought it? I looked up comps and I couldn't really see anything. Uh, this pair of shorts, I'd never seen before. This logo, once again, tell me I left this. Uh, should I have brought that? Don't know that brand there that's on there. Uh, Tom X. Has anyone ever brought Tom X before? I couldn't really find anything good on comps. So that's another thing I left. I want you guys to tell me in comments if there's anything that I did pick up there that I didn't buy because remember I am learning clothes still. Uh, I did pick up some cool stuff. I have no fucking idea what that Soviet fucking brand is. Um, I did pick up these and I'll show you on Thursday's uh, show and tell. But I found these, um, even though I couldn't really find anything on comps, this is a West brand, um, some surfing brand, but these look pretty cool. I think they're purple. I'm going to put in my listings they're purple. You tell me, are they purple or not? They look purple to me. Uh, they're definitely not brown. I'm pretty sure they're purple maroon, but I'm grabbing them because I reckon they'll fucking go. Didn't get this jacket in the end. Uh, can't remember what brand it is. If you can see it on the screen there, what uh, brand it is. Uh, Mososo, Mososo, something like that. Um, I'm not sure if it goes. I was actually going to buy it and just wing it um, for $12, Mososo. But it uh, had a few rips in it, so I didn't bother. So we fucked off out of that one. I've got a few cool little things that I'll show you on Thursday. Um, we're going into this op shop. This op shop's uh, pretty good. Actually, this is the one where I got the toast of the nose uh, shirt, not the first one. There you go. I look for the jeans. It's all Jeans West and um, Connor brand. If you're in Australia, you'll know what the Connor brand. Same with the uh, shirts in this place today. That was all Connor brand. Uh, I'm pretty sure a lot of you will be familiar with what Connor is. Connor is a store over here. It's a store over here in Western Australia anyway. Um... I'll, I'll buy from Connor, but I'm not going to buy a second hand to sell. Does anyone ever buy these little uh, biker shirts? Uh, I'm not going to condone it and buy it because I don't like these fuckers on my road and they get in my way when I'm driving, so I left it. Didn't even look it up. Uh, that's a uh, fake a fake uh, Arsenal shirt there. Gunners, I would have brought it if it was real, but that was definitely fake. Know your fakes from your real uh, sports jerseys. Um, I didn't, this is, look like I said, first time buying clothes, I didn't, uh, this was just a fake brand, it wasn't a proper Marvel brand that, uh, Captain America, so I didn't buy it, but I wouldn't have mind wearing it myself, to be honest. Um, I did find a beauty in here, there's a school, of, I didn't buy this, School of Rock Motion Picture shirt, uh, that was from 2011, I'm pretty sure. I didn't bother with it, um, I didn't think it would go, maybe I'm wrong, fuck these little fucking night at the bloody garden toys and characters freak me out i hate that show oh, fuck that is a creepy there's a creepy thing for kids that's a i didn't pick it up as creepy shit i didn't bother with bold and the beautiful this time even though i had good luck with bold and the beautiful last time i think i still got one bold and the beautiful left uh, i'm not sure but uh, they wanted 10 bucks for this box set i couldn't guarantee it was sell uh maybe it was just luck last time um last time it sold for me so i didn't bother with uh bold and the beautiful this time but i got some all right stuff all right so far i've been to two uh, it's kind of a little bit of a dog shit day that's all right we've got vinnie's vinnie's is always shit and then there's another one that i never fucking go to so we'll check that one out uh so far all their prices look like they've hell going up since uh christmas uh, I don't know if I'm missing something or not, but I did say I wasn't coming back up shopping, but let's do it. Alrighty, let's do the Vinnies. No one ever likes a Vinnies. Uh, they had the old usual shit, the, the too high of prices. I had a look for the CDs. I did find this one game, Game On Couple. Craig has been trying to help me out with it, the uh, Street Fighter game. I'll show you on show and tell. I might have to smash it against the wall. Piss me off. Tried to find a Kiss record for my bingo. And no luck. I only found uh, crappy old shit and some uh, Kamal. As we always, always just find Kamal. No Kiss ones for my bingo. Actually, I didn't find anything for my bingo today. Uh, this day shirt. I didn't buy it. It was 8 bucks. I never heard of it. I'm still learning. Tell me if I missed out on that as well. That guy's coming out from just taking a shit. 
Uh, there's a fucking East Perth Royals uh, 2016 women's um, women's training jersey. I do pick that up. I do pick that up. I'll probably only get about 20 bucks for that and cost me 6 bucks. But I wanted to grab it because I love getting football merchandise. I did find this Star Wars shirt. It was not vintage, unfortunately. I had a look at the year. Uh, it was 2014, I'm pretty sure it said on it. And um, I was trying to knock my first one off my bingo list and uh, it didn't work. Um, I had a look through these ones. These are expensive ones. There was no way in hell I was buying a Queen with Adam Lambert. Uh, there's no way. That's not the real Queen. There's no way in hell I'm buying it. I don't care if it sells. I'm against it. Ooh, it's fucking hot. It's hot, hot, hot. Uh, that ginger kid freaked me out. Uh, the ginger kid served me. He freaked me out. He was like a robot and kept on saying the same things every time because I saw something out of the corner of my eye. I'm not going to show you now. I'll show you a show and tell. I just got to talk to Game On Couple, Craig, to see if it's uh, actually a gem or not, but I'll still show it regardless. Uh, but I will be showing that to Craig. Um, yeah, that was a bit dog shit. I found two things. Uh, and then the first one, I found one thing. The second shop, I found about three things. So, it's been an okay day. It hasn't been dog shit. I haven't gotten nothing. Uh, there's one more on the corner there, which is a bit of a dog shit shop. But I can't leave this area and not do one more. So, I need a schmock. I need a schmock. Let me get a smoke into me, and we'll go over to that one. All right, we're going into Save the Children op shop. This is the last one for this ride along. Heal the world, make it a better place. That dude was just looking at me thinking, what the fuck? So what? I want to sing fucking for Save the Children. Does it matter if it was a Michael Jackson song? All right, this one is usually pretty shit. It is usually pretty shit. But we're going to do it. I'm happy with what I've got so far today, but I don't think kitty's gonna add up. I don't think the kitty is gonna add up. It's not like garage sales and, uh, it's not like garage sales and um, your good old markets, which are my favorites. Let's do it. All right, 50% off orange tickets. Well, this store was absolutely useless. Save the children. Well, they need to save themselves because their prices are just insane. They wanted for these Law and Order, a bunch of Law and Order DVDs, they wanted like 30 or 40 bucks, I think it was, for 10 seasons. Some people might think it's good. I thought it was dog shit. So they can go suck a dick as well. Uh, I moved on to the CDs. At two bucks each, you've got to find a really special one to be able to um, justify paying two dollars. Found this old school 80s Inspector Gadget jigsaw puzzle. I wanted to grab it. I wanted to grab it, but on the side, there was heaps of scribble. And I'm not into scribble. I don't want scribble on my box. Don't you scribble on my box, alright? I looked for the clothes. The clothes were so marked up. There's no, like... Five dollars for every shirt or anything like that, like you get at most op shops, thrift shops. It was just insane, like fucking ten dollars, nine dollars, and all that. So fuck that. I wasn't having a part of that. Was not having a part. I'm out the door. I'm out of here. I'm fucking out of this door. Oh, it's fucking hot. What is it? It's 32. All right, that wasn't a very exciting ride along. I apologise, but maybe it was for you. So. Hit a thumbs up if you uh, enjoyed it. If you didn't like it, maybe go back, watch all the other shit I've done. Promise you I'm going to get some uh, better stuff and do some better ride-alongs. That's the best I can fucking do. Save the fucking children. Well, I'll tell you right now, they ain't going to save no fucking children with those prices. Fucking children are going to be going hungry if all that money goes towards the fucking children. Jesus. So, yeah, that was pretty bad. I'm sweating me balls off. Alright guys, cheers for watching, uh, if you haven't liked, like, subscribe, do what the fuck you want, uh, I'm going to go out again, I'm on holidays, I'm going to scratch that thrift itch, 
and uh, I'm still on holidays uh, another week after this one airs so anyone wants me on their uh, channel for a live I am free and I will come on and talk some shit with you all right don't forget to join us on Thursday for show and tell uh, I'll show you everything I got look I got a bag full of shit so I'll show you everything I got and uh, fingers crossed the kitty is sweet all right guys cheers for watching I'm gonna go home I'm busting for a fucking piss and there's no toilets anywhere I need a drink as well I need a fucking drink mmm all right guys cheers for watching see you Come ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift all day.